the progress to turn the Democratic Republic of Congo into a strong trade partner, as well as a billion-dollar export market for Uganda, is seriously picking up momentum with the establishment of one-stop border points. Goli Border Point is one of the trade infrastructure under construction by Trademark East Africa with support from the British government. So Goli is one of the key border posts uh, between Uganda and DRC. Uh, it feeds, it leads into a major town in DRC called Bunya. So a lot of the cargo, either transit cargo that is going through Uganda or the Northern Corridor coming through Bosia, Gulu, uh, then it comes to Goli, it goes to Bunya. But then also a lot of domestic trade uh, from Uganda, our exports, go through Goli into, uh, into the DRC and Bunya, the Bunya area. So that's why Goli is actually very important and that's why as uh, Trademark East Africa in Uganda we decided to, uh, to seek support from the UK government through the FCDO to fund Goli. Uh, the total cost of the project is $2.6 million, but uh, particularly on the construction. But then also government is putting in its own funding to make sure that the land is secured. So the expectations for Goli is that there will be improved service delivery, there will be reduced clearance time, especially for people destined to Congo. And I also like to, to, to report that our counterpart on the, on the other side of Congo are also constructing a one-stop border point. So this border is going to be a key milestone. It will help to smoothen every process that is supposed to be in a one-stop border. Currently, Uganda's export value to Congo is more than 500 million US dollars. And besides the border point, the concerted effort by Uganda to even build road inside Congo and the warm political ties the two countries enjoy connote what the Congo-Uganda bilateral trade ties hold for the next few years. Ismail Musa, Ladu. NTV Business.